Hi, I'm Jennifer from Me Time. Thank you for joining me today on this Bella Box Let's Celebrate Little Tip video. In this video, we're going to share four tips for, for embroidering on Minky. We used Minky on this cute little cinch sack to make the dog look like he was, has fuzzy fur. Me Time, we deliver machine embroidery experiences right to your doorstep. We offer four subscriptions that you can go check out at metimedelivered.com. Okay, let's get started on these tips. First, um, you wanna make sure that you choose a stabilizer that is um, a little bit sturdy because minking can be a little bit stretchy. Fortunately, we also have this canvas bag, so that helps um, not feel quite, that helps with the stretchiness. The second tip is to use, make sure that you tape your minky down really well onto your cinch sack. Um, and that's because Minky is really slippery and slick. And if you have it taped down, then it's gonna hold it in place better. Our third tip is to use a wash away topping for the Minky. And here you can see this, there's a little, it's harder to see in the video, but we have a wash away topping here. We haven't washed away yet. And the topping is there to help with the stitches so they don't get lost and hidden in the thicker uh, fabric here. And our fourth tip is to make sure that you stitch out all of the designs first before you wash away the topping. Because if you do, then you have wet fabric and you have to wait for it to dry. So stitch everything first and then wash away your topping in warm water. Okay, so there's also a bonus cat design in this kit if you prefer cats over dogs. The Minky works the same on either design. Thank you for joining me today. Go like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the Me Time videos. We have videos on how to make um, the garland longer, how to stitch out the on balsa wood, and how to use wash away bobbin. Now go enjoy some well-deserved Me Time.